So my name is Karen Haberstroh, and I'm a faculty member in the engineering department at Brown University. Um, I'm also a program chair for the BMES meeting in Hartford in 2011, so I'll be responsible for the scientific content of the conference. The new debt, well, first of all, I guess the opening date for abstracts is coming up very soon, so that will be on February 8th. Um, the abstract deadline this year is very important to take note of because it's actually much earlier than it has been in the past. So in the past, the abstract deadline has been in early May, and this year the abstract deadline will be April 5th, which is a Tuesday. Um, and one of the reasons that we're pushing that abstract date forward is to make sure that um, we have plenty of time for the review process and to make sure that we have a, a solid review process. In terms of the abstracts themselves, um, again, they're, they're different from in the past. In the past, you probably remember that the BMES abstracts are more on the order of a paragraph in length. Um, this year, the abstract is more like an extended abstract, so one page in length. And it's really like a condensed paper that you might submit for publication. So we're asking people to include an introduction section, materials and methods, um, results, and also a conclusion section. And uh, we really want to make sure that there's a good quality of the abstracts being submitted and that people can really display their best work. And that's often difficult to do in a short one paragraph format. So we've moved to this one page format to allow um, the researchers who are submitting their work to really be able to showcase um, their best data, their best results, and to talk about that in the context of, of society. Um, so we're really excited about the BMES meeting in Hartford. We're looking forward to people submitting their abstracts to showcasing their best work. And we would encourage you to pay attention to that opening date of February 8th. And also um, spread the word to your colleagues that uh, there is a new abstract template format and also the new deadline of, um, of April 5th. And again, we look forward to receiving your abstracts and seeing you in Hartford.